Hey guys and welcome back to my channel. We are going into it. I am about to enter this new kind of way of eating. I'm going to be doing a five meal a day plan. I met with my trainer and nutritionist. So we kind of figured this out. I want to tell you how we got to the five meals a day and also the breakdown of what I'm going to be eating for each meal. So I will kind of get into that. But basically first and last meal are going to be protein shakes. That will be uh, just protein powder, water. I'm going to do half an avocado because I will have healthy fats with those two meals. And then for the other three meals, I'm going to be eating every three hours, guys. So I'll probably kick it off around nine. And then every three hours after that, I will have a meal until my last meal, which is my protein shake. And for the other three, it'll be a protein, healthy fat, and carbs. So well-balanced meal, something that's going to keep me full and also make sure I'm hitting my macros. So we're going to do 30 uh, grams of protein and then 20 of healthy fat and healthy carbs. So I'll put that kind of in the screen for you. I'll give you a screenshot of our text and kind of the diet plan I'm going to be on. We got to that number um, by adjusting it by my weight. Basically, you want to take for the protein, what, how much you weigh, right? and then you want to divide it by the five meals. So that's how you come up with that number. My number is 30 for the protein, and then we went 20 for the fats, like I said, the healthy fats and the carbs, and that's gonna be for the three meals, and once again, the other two meals are just gonna be protein shakes. So I will show you guys this week at least one full day of eating. I don't know how many uh, meals I'm gonna take because I feel like a lot of them are gonna be pretty repetitive because of how small my list is, my carbs that I can eat, basically rice, potatoes, um, no bread, no pasta, none of the good carbs. I just want to have, you know, something that's not going to pack on that weight as I'm trying to lean out. And then for my protein, you know, lean meat. So lean ground turkey, chicken breast. Of course, you can have fish. I don't like seafood. So the only thing I do like is tuna packs. I'll probably use that. I can use a couple tuna packs to hit my um, protein goal for a meal. So I'll probably do that like in a salad. So like I said, I will show you guys throughout this week kind of how I'm eating, how I'm adjusting to it, give you guys a full day of eating, show you guys a little bit of my workouts because I know I didn't get any in that last video, just my hike, but I will definitely get some more content when it comes to me working out. But as you guys know, if you're trying to slim down, you're trying to lose weight, you do have to be on top of it with your eating. So even my trainer, my nutritionist was like, look, we can do the work in here, but you're gonna have to do that work out there. So I'm gonna show you guys what I got, uh, my protein powder and a couple other things I got to start this journey. And then we'll kind of get into the vlog and I'll show you guys, at least like I said, a full day of eating. So thank you guys for checking back in. Wish me luck as I make these changes. Like I said, we're gonna do this for two weeks and then go back and adjust. Of course, I'm gonna have Thanksgiving dinner. That's gonna be like my one cheat meal, but I'm not gonna do any cheating uh, up until then. And then after then, probably for another couple weeks because I really, really wanna do this for myself. So hopefully this information helps you guys. If you do have any questions, that you would like me to personally ask my trainer or nutritionist below um just comment below and just let me know what you want and i'll definitely include that in my next video so if you do have any personal questions for yourself maybe you have a number that you're at and you kind of want to figure out how to get there maybe i could do a little q a with them and help you guys out so i really want to give this information back to you because i know how tough these journeys like can be it's a ongoing thing it's up and down this year has been crazy very inconsistent so i hope that this video can help you guys out. And like I said, I'm gonna get into like a little mini haul of what I picked up. This is just stuff from Amazon. So let me go grab that and I'll be right back. All right, you guys, so the first thing I got is this protein powder and you want to do the isolated, the ISO uh, protein powder if you're trying to lose weight, that's gonna help you out versus like bulking and stuff. So this will be great for one of my meals, 25 grams of protein. I will add a little bit more to hit the 30 for my shake. And uh, I can add it into like oatmeal to hit my protein for that meal. So definitely a few different options that you could do with this. It's 120 calories, uh, two carbs. Protein is what I'm really focused on, less than a gram of sugar. I got the gourmet chocolate flavor and it's pretty good. Next, I bought a new scale. So I just got this digital scale from Amazon as well. Like I said, everything will be listed below, but it also um, does have an app that you can use with it and you can track like your body fat and all this other stuff. My other one didn't have that. So this will be great. I need to keep track and try to not go crazy on weighing myself, but I'm excited to see that number go down. So I picked that up and speaking of scales, I got this kitchen scale only like 15 bucks, I think $14. And it's cool because 
it like um, will zero out your plate. So if you wanna put your plate on it, you can like zero that out minus it and then put your protein on it and really kind of figure out how much you know, you're know you having for your meals. I need to track that pretty accurately. So some things I'll be able to know like with my protein powder or like oatmeal, but stuff like that, like chicken and potatoes, rice, I could definitely use this and it'd be a really big help. Like I said, 14 bucks, super affordable. Um, the scale I think was around the same, maybe 20 bucks and the protein powder was like $40. And then I got one last thing. My last thing is my waist kind of trainer belt for working out. Um, let me show you. So I don't can see um this it's really cool at first i was like how does it work but um am i on the right way yeah so this it's like a double wrap so you just put this around your waist one time right and then it has another like piece of velcro thing at first i was like this doesn't work but you pull it you can pull this band out and like really like suck it in tight so this is a little waist trainer kind of thing for working out so it'll help me with my um form and whatnot and to keep me sucked in while I'm working out so that's what i got you guys that's my little haul and uh like i said i'll give you guys a full day of eating if you have any questions hit me below and i will check back in with you guys throughout the week hey guys and welcome to week two i am just waiting here at the gate actually at my personal trainer's place oh here we are Let's pull in, get this workout in. I have my first meal of the day. As you guys know, I started my nutrition plan. So five meals a day, my first one being the protein shake. So I got that in. Now we're about to get this workout in. Let's do it. All right, so this is the menu for tonight. Plus, I need to figure out what I want to do for my fat. I'll probably just do another half of an avocado, maybe like a little side salad to begin with and just throw that on top. Nothing too crazy, but I can load up on as many vegetables as I want. So I wanted to do a couple for tonight's dinner. And I'm not going to have red meat that often, but every once in a while, it's nice to throw it in there because, you know, turkey, ground turkey and chicken gets a little boring i don't really like seafood like that uh, i do tuna like the packs on my salad and stuff so yeah this is always a nice option to switch things up so we're gonna have this steak it's been marinating we actually have this pretty cool little indoor grill situation don't mind this it's not on yet um but it's a little dirty but um we have this because we don't have an art an outdoor grill so that's nice for like steaks and whatnot stuff like that so gonna do the brown rice for my carb then we're gonna have this is my protein like i said vegetables i can kind of have a limited number of vegetables in this diet and probably have an avocado for the fat and this will be my fourth meal of the day and then we'll follow it up with a protein shake in a few hours all right guys first meal of the day as you know as i broke down my macros we're doing just protein and healthy fats so got my protein powder this is the gourmet chocolate flavor i do like it and then the avocado just kind of gives it that richness and cuts that protein and like kind of fake chocolate flavor it's not bad but all protein powders are gonna have that protein taste so i do like the avocado in it i wasn't sure about it but it works and it's super good so we're gonna just do a, a little over a scoop actually i do a scoop and a little bit extra because i need the uh 30 grams of protein then half of an avocado a couple ice cubes some water we're gonna mix it up and get this morning going well, i'm working out i got a few things going on i'm about to pop in some potatoes into the air fryer and I'm gonna do some eggs some avocado for my second meal of the day and i'm getting these chicken thighs ready they were already seasoned and honestly the only thing i can find chicken wise at the store i'm supposed to stick to leaner cuts of meat so chicken breast but my trainer said that this would be fine so not all the time but i'm gonna do it tonight in the crock pot i'm gonna put those in i'm gonna probably put some more potatoes in with that and do a veggie so we're gonna get this going also i'm getting this ready to take with me to the radio station i'm gonna go in and uh, I need to bring a meal with me since I'm eating every three hours. So I'm going to do for my carbs, 
the rolled oats. So we're gonna make some oatmeal, throw some protein powder in it. So it's gonna be like a chocolate kind of oatmeal. So that'll be my um, protein and my carb. And then for my fat, I got some almonds. So I'm gonna do a handful of these pretty much. Six equals 16 grams, any 20. So I'll probably do like eight or so almonds. So I'm just gonna pack this up and get this ready to go with me to work. You guys, you don't even know. This is bomb. I was actually like really, really surprised of how good this turned out. Um, just left this going for like six hours. Just tasted it. Potatoes are perfect. We shredded up the chicken in there. And now we're just microwaving some veggies. About to have a little side salad with my avocado so I can get my fat in. And we're about to be good to go for dinner. And then my last meal, of course, will be my protein shake with the other half of the avocado. <laughs> It is Saturday. I just got done with my workout. That is why we have a filter on that is not matching my neck. What the heck? The filter should go all the way. All the skin, baby. But uh, anyways, it's a weekend before Thanksgiving. It's really busy. I'm going to be out running a whole bunch of errands. So probably going to end the vlog here. Um, I hope I included enough for you guys. I'm trying to break it up and not put as much meals in each uh, week because I'm going to be repeating a lot of meals. So I'm trying to keep it for like at least a full day of eating, maybe a, a meal or two extra. Yes, I'm going to be sticking to my plan next week, even though we do have Thanksgiving. Of course, I'm going to enjoy that with my family, uh, immediate family that I live with that I see all the time. Okay no traveling corona uh -uh. i've gone all 2020 without getting sick i'm not gonna get sick now i hope you guys are gonna stay safe i wish you a happy holiday i'm gonna probably end the vlog here i'm grabbing some coffee and i will see you next week